Sea of Plates, Squad Battles, Spanish Civil War, Alto de Leon 2 scenario. Republican turn 5 of 8. Okay. Turn on the unit uh, used movement points button. Okay. Um, I think I'm pushing on to that objective there. Um, not that that's. And we can go squad by squad. Um, visibility is still at three hexes. Um, 21, 20 hours. Okay. There. There. Okay. Um, same deal. Follow. At least that force goes this way. Maybe this force will go. Um, around here. So we'll take this one. Take the first. Let's see. Half squad. Yeah. They go. Through the brush. That I guess they can go like that, and then here. Uh, this is probably what it's just going to take too long. Probably, probably. All right, here. Pinned, um, pinned leader. So select the leader, select leader menu, rally units, and there we go. Um, oh, and they drew fire for that. Oh, all right. Um, They will fire, yes they will, they will fire adjacent there. Um, okay, um, now here, oh no, all right, we'll take the leader there and Rally, oh, rally two units at once. So now we'll take all of them. Actually, actually, there's not a point to waste because I fired on the pinned unit. So I believe that they should not recover this turn. So to pour more fire in there, other than the possibility of getting casualties, which I don't think is pretty much, in most cases, that's not a very high probability. I'm basically wasting effectiveness. Yeah, I think I am. All right. So that's that. And then here, this unit's good. So let's try hand grenade. Again, okay, they used all their grenades. Yeah. Didn't accomplish anything there. Um, there's no point in trying to assault because because um, the defenders aren't pinned or even disrupted. Yeah, this force, I'd like to hold them back. But, yeah, by another, 
another way to look at it is that I'm running out of time again. So let's do this. Let's <laughs> oh, that was now this I don't understand. Why I I believe a unit like this, I believe in a design sense that the, the unit should go to ground. I don't see Oh. Actually one exception to that is that if on ground is is not supposed to always mean literally on ground, okay. Okay. That's one exception. All right. Next, uh, we're moving in. Um, oh, they made it. They made it. So they were lucky. <laughs> they dashed forward and they were lucky. Okay. Here also, pin pinned. I'll pin this is. Frustrating, but I can't say it's unrealistic. I, I cannot say it's unrealistic. Fortunately, I think I have to send, let's see, send uh, you know, more forces in there. Um, yep, there they go. Oh, they made it too. Oh, interesting. Oh. My problem is, though, is that these defenders, oh, well, they're disrupted, but still, I want them to, to be pinned. Um, it's not going to happen. Timing again. Not that that's the, not that that's always the uh, explanation, but again, I'll say that this is a timing issue. Creating the effects at the right time to sequence your actions to be to have the highest probability of success timing is is uh, is part of it this is to to do this to play this scenario again by the way another good another good squad battle scenario um, I think I would do things quite different. I'm not sure I would spread out like this. Maybe I should try echeloning along a narrow, basically a narrow axis. Okay, but I'll continue playing out this at least a, at least a bit more. But I think that there are problems with how I've tried this. Yeah, okay. Uh... I mean, the thing here is I don't have time to go all the way around. We're talking one, you know, two, three, four. Yeah, I've already run out of time. There's no way to, yeah. Just not gonna, just not gonna happen. Okay, so they're on ground. They on ground. What happened here? Try this. Oh, what's going on here? Um. Oh, okay. No way. They should still be able. Okay, I guess I had to choose one at a time. These two on ground. Okay. All right. Now let's do advance the turn. Things are not not looking good. I'm too spread out, running out of time. Um, yeah, it's not good, but still fun. Sign of a great series that uh, I have fun even when I'm losing. Um, let's see, yeah, I think I might have, I think I need to try echeloning on a narrow axis and at least see how that works. 
think it should be better though.